We're at an incredibly exciting point in the, the shift of the economics of space. Those of us in the space industry, we see it every day. Uh, I'm not sure the general public sees it as much, but we're going from a space economy that was really all government funded for 60 or more years, uh, both the military side and the NASA side, and we're in the midst of a shift to a commercial space economy. And that's a huge shift. It's a huge shift in, in thinking about how we do space. It's a huge space, huge difference in the targets that we go after in space, because obviously private companies have a much uh, different view of what you need to get out of space than, than uh, the science community does or, or the defense department does. But you're seeing a, a proliferation of companies now that are doing things that, uh, that NASA and DOD had no interest in doing or at least uh, didn't put any funding against it, from mining asteroids to uh, taking tourists up to hotels in space uh, to, uh, to a number of different activities. And then there are actually revenue-generating activities, such as uh, pharmaceutical companies wanting to develop new drugs and microgravity, the science community wanting to develop uh, cures for new diseases. There's a, there's a huge thrust of new economic uh, activity going on in space. And, our company's kind of got a foot on both sides. We've, we've been around for 50 years, so we're not a new company. We've been a 50-year aerospace company. 25 years we've been sending things into space. And uh, the interesting thing is uh, people are talking about commercial space as, a, as a, if it's a new thing. Uh, commercial space has been around for decades. Uh, telecommunications satellites is commercial space. Uh, Direct TV is commercial space. XM radio is commercial space. Uh, commercial space is not a new phenomenon. What tends to be new is, is the change between what they call old space and new space. And old space is an economy that's based on the government funding all the space activities. And new space, to me, is the economy moving towards entrepreneurs and commercial companies getting involved in space. And that's, I think, where the excitement is. It's a changing in the funding sources. It's a changing in the economics in terms of where you're trying to get benefit out of space. Uh, you're seeing a lot of uh, billionaires that are coming in and funding space activities, which is really exciting. I, I uh, was joking at a conference a week or so ago that uh, I had a four-step plan for getting a commercial space company started. And step one was find a billionaire that's really <laughs> interested in space uh, with a corollary that he's, he's willing to become a millionaire. 